That was a quick goal. That's what Midwest needed. Get them started. Kelsch got it out. Burgoyne's got it there. No, he's held up. All up again. Kelsch again. He's dominating the ruck. Burgoyne missed it. Remy North out. King O'Loughlin gets it. Marks well. To Bascom. Down the wing. He's got a man out in the wing here. Goes back into the centre. To Burgoyne. Burgoyne to Montgomery. To King. King kicks for goal. I reckon, no, far north have taken a good mark there. Good mark. Balls get pushed over. Kelsch missed it, but Stringer has it. Then he handballs to McAvoy. Cameron Mont getting ready to... And then Otis Carter gets the ball out. So Remy North's running after it. So is Cam Mont. Cam Mont out again. To Jared... Jared Sampson. He's passed off to Bascom. Bascom goes for goal, and that's a goal. It's now four goals, two to tw 26, to two goals, none, 12. So Str McAvoy gets it down straight in the hands of Montgomery. He's going to line up for goal. Montgomery's normally a, a reliable kick. Bit of a heavy ball though. Doesn't quite reach the distance. Far north have it, and they get it, clear it. Looking for options, switch. Back in the pocket. Far north, bag kick. No, that didn't come off too well. But they still got it. No, that's well tackled there. So uh, the ball's out on the boundary. And then Newton taps out. McAvoy. Montgomery missed it there. Uh, it's a bit of a scramble, but I reckon Stringer's got it. Yeah, he's got rid of it. Kosminski, Kelsch. Kelsch kicks for goal, but I think he's too short again. Far north have it. Good mark on the uh, 
pocket. Kelsh up again. Takes a good mark. He's dominating here. No, missed the target, I think. I can't see. <laughs> and there's a behind. Four goals, three, 27. Two goals. Straight. To so say Gum kick, gets hold of it, Stringer takes a mark in the centre. Handball's off to Gum again. And into where? All by himself, he runs in towards goal. And that's a beautiful kick. And that's another goal. No, Midwest very happy with that one. So it's five goals, three. That'd be 33 points to uh, Far North 12. So Far North haven't scored this, this quarter. Yeah, it looks like it's a pretty good game, Cookie. It's uh, Midwest, a couple of goals in this, uh, this half sort of thing, and the, that's putting them in front, giving them a bit of a break. Yes, it was very close first quarter, but um, no, it's sort of breaking away now. So Midwest. Ball up in the centre. Good hit out so, by, by... Yeah, Kelshi. Kelsh to Stringer. Stringer's dominating in the centre there. Good good, good tackle there too by the, the far north player. Another ball up. Tap out to far, to, uh, yep, far north. Yep, and it's gone out the back. This is Steve Pohl. Handball's out. Yeah, good tackle there again. Held, up, held the ball up well. So definitely Mont holding the ball. Montgomery gets the free, holding the ball. Midwest doing a good job holding the ball up at centre half back. So Montgomery kicks out to Dudley. Handball's off to Gum. Yeah, great bit of run there by Gum. Gum's nice kick, but it's it's gone to the wrong man, gone to far north. Name of the game playing in front, and that was far west. They head down to the outer side wing. And Gum's there again, but he's it's gone to the boundary. That's a great kick by Midwest, but unfortunately at the back there was the uh, far north player and a great mark. Good mark. He's looking for options here. No, he's going down the line. Yeah, it's a good long kick on the grandstand side. They head Quite up. a pack. And Gum's there. He's taking the mark, but I don't... No, he's called it. It's a mark. Gum playing pretty good on the uh, half-back flank there, Cookie. Yes, he's a, uh, he can dominate. He's uh, definitely got form. He's going to wear. No, it missed him. Got Bascom. Far north have it now. There's a free kick to far north. Pushing the back. Left half back flank goes out to the left wing. But good mark by Montgomery. Old Midwest by Mont Montgomery takes a good mark. Kicks into the centre. To to Burgoyne. No, it missed. Far north get it out. Handball off. Bask Bascom has the ball. They're holding it up on Far North here. Far North really aren't getting it past centre forward, so Sampson has it. Good mark on the uh, almost wing. Oh, big pack. 
There's a bit of fly there. Scrambly, we've got Carter. No, far north have got it out again. So, tussle between Gum and Far North. Gum's got it. Bascom got rid of it. Handball out Far North for a down, going down the far wing. Free kick to Far North. Yeah, right. He's gone. Yes, no second. There's Gum again. He's got it. He's getting plenty of the ball. Bascom, far north. Paul, Gum. Great smother there. Grokey. Yep. Good tap. Kosminski. Sampson. North. Far north clearing kick out to the uh, grandstand side wing there. Drop mark by far north. Still punching the ball forward. Oh, and it's gone over the top of his head. Yeah, oh, great tackle. Yeah, that's Cameron Mont. I reckon that's that's a free kick holding the ball. Beautiful. Into Bascom. Bascom's been prominent. He's to Mo Montgomery again. Down the wing to Kelsch. Kelsch missed. Jake McAvoy. Kick it out to Sampson. Sampson's got rid of it. Oh, there's a bit of a tackle there. It's free to far north. Yep, the 15-minute penalty paid as well. So he's going to line up pretty much on a 45-degree angle, but I actually know he's going to push him all the way into the uh, into the goal square, so it'll be directly in front. Should be a certain goal to Midwest. <laughs> yeah, so yep. another, another goal there to Midwest. Cookie, and they're streaming away. They're going to be 6 3 39 to just the two goals, 12. That's all right. No, they're starting to uh, get a fair break here now. I think they'd be very pleased with that if, if that's their plan. I think Far North Cook will be looking forward to the half-time break to try and reassess where they're, uh, where they're going to come out and try and get their goals. They've played a lot of the, uh, lot of the game on their half-forward line, but they can't go any further. That's right. They're not able to get it up into the forward, forward um, 50. So, But anyway, Kelsch again with a good tap, but go to Far North. Great clearance out to the uh, grandstand side wing. Oh, and that's a that's a great mark if he's paid it. Oh, no. yeah, that's yes, a good mark, has. good juggling mark. And he's played on down the half forward flank. Unfortunately, it's all uh, midwest there. Oh, that's a good tackle. Yep. Brody Grokey, he's got it, he's held it up. Ball up. He's tried to bat charge through. Free kick. Midwest. Bascom has the ball. He's looking for options. Kicks down the grandstand wing to Kelsch. Kelsch gets hands on it. To Dudley. Dudley kicks on to King. Kelsch gets it out. Ware get, gets under it. So Ware gets a free kick. I oh know. He yeah, no, he's paid the other way for a shepherd off yep. the ball, I think. That's what it is. Ball, ball not quite within the, uh, the the 10 metres or 5 metres that the umpire deemed it to be. So, of course, that's, uh, yeah, P pushed him underneath the ball. So, clear free kick to uh, far north. Far north. 
Far north down the down the wing. Now a good mark. He's got options up forward. Long kick down to the half forward flank. Oh, he's oh, up. He's, he almost grabbed that with his, but not quite. Held up in a, a ball will be bowled up. As Beebs would call it from last year, Cookie, it would be stacks on. <laughs> yes, no Beebs is in Coffins Bay these days. I'm sure he'll be listening in. That's a great clearing kick. Yep. Just center half back, run through the centre. That's Bascom on to... On to Stringer. Stringer's on, got plenty of space. Horgan. He can even take Horgan's a bounce if he wants. the youngest player here. So, King O'Loughlin, he's got it. He's got a handball out to Carter. Carter's got it up. He's got it to Sampson. Sampson has kicked a nice goal there. Yeah, that was a great bit of play. Started at the centre half back from a good mark and then straight down to the, the left hand, uh, the right hand wing and then a uh, great kick by Sampson there around the corner. So it's 6-3 to two goals straight. So uh, it's actually... I think they're going to call that 7-3 actually. I think, I think they right. will call that 7-3 because they haven't quite got it up yet. But anyway, that's all right. Too much action for the scoreboard. So clearly a really good second quarter by Midwest here. They've, uh, they've kicked four goals uh, in probably about 10, 15, 15 minutes. So, uh, yeah, far north are going to need to do something pretty quickly here to stop going into the halftime break with a big deficit. Yes, the, uh, there wouldn't be much time left either, I would have thought. But Kenny, Kenny's got the ball. He's tapped it on. Keeps it going forward. Right, far, far north have it now. So Montgomery pushes it over. Out of bounds on the uh, centenary left-hand side on the wing. Ball in. Kelsh up. Kelsh didn't get really hands to it. No, pushed underneath the ball. It's there's the stacks on. There's Stringer again. He's always in it. Yeah, good tackle wrapped up there by Stringer. Midwest just seemed to be a little bit harder at the ball at the moment. Kelsh pushed under it, but that's Stringer's still in there. Far North are working hard, but not getting the ball out. Plenty of players around the ball, clearing handballs, what they Kelsh. need, and they got it. No, far North, well done. Needs to look for someone, he's got no one around. No, him. Samson's he's Samson's caught him. got him, and that's holding the ball. Samson all over the ground at the moment, Cookie. He sure is. No, he's he's a good leader, he, he runs Great well. Great into the centre by number 22, yeah. which is... Uh, Kosminski. Kosminski. Yep, to uh, Burgoyne. Burgoyne then runs on, behind. I think. No, he's, he's oh, shepherded he's got, is that where? beautifully. No, I think that's Dudley. Dudley, is that a great kick? No, he's just missed to the right-hand side. Great effort, though, uh, from clearing again yep. once again from the centre-half back position. Yep. Good running there. Could only be a minute or two left, I would have thought. But yeah, Looks like about uh, yeah, 20 minutes gone by looks on the uh, on the clock. So far north kick out. Up, no one, no mark. Handball. And we got Burgoyne again. Burgoyne Very short. Clever little chip, didn't quite make the distance. We've got Stringer again. He is That's a great dominating over this ground. That's Good a great mark. heads up kick there. Uh, I'm not sure who's quite got that cookie. Um, I'm just having a look. That's King. King O'Loughlin. Yeah, King O'Loughlin. Just sitting there in the uh, in the forward pocket and uh, yeah, it was a great great heads up kick straight to him. He'll be lining up from about 35, 40 out. He's got a thumping kick, but we're not sure where this could go, though. That's a great kick heading towards the goals. It's just drifted across to the right-hand side for a point. And that's the uh, half-time siren cookie. What score have we got? Yes, we have 7-4, 46 to two goals, zip, 12 points. So, uh, yeah, it's a 34-point it's uh, lead at this stage. Yeah, that was a very interesting uh, half of football there. I, I think uh, Far North are going to need to come out and be a hell of a lot stronger if they're going to uh, going to try and get this def deficit of five five odd goals. Yes, Far North were probably fairly lacking there. They were, just seemed to lack that bit of zip and probably hardness at the ball. So uh, Midwest, they certainly were very um, very dominant actually. In fact, they uh, they uh, had their main players. They were all around the ground all all the time. Most of their play too in that quarter was actually played on the half forward flank for uh, far north. But uh, yeah, Gum there just held them up on just every single attack they could. And, and then towards the end of that quarter, they just dominated at centre half back and just pushed the ball straight to their forward position to get a goal. 
Yeah, we had uh, the centre centre and the, and the uh, stoppages and things were dominated by Kelsch and um, and Stringer, and uh, then we had uh, you know other other Kosminski and um, Samson were also very handy around the ground too. And Bergon and Ware floating around in the forward line too were pretty handy. I think we're time for a break, Cookie. Optus 4G Plus Network now covers more of you than ever. So you can post fast, watch fast, play fast, just like me. So ready to get into the uh, third quarter here. So there's a 35 point deficit, ball up, Carter gets it out. Oh, that was a big tap, but it went straight to far north. Stringer again, he bounces off. No, he might be held up here. Yeah, Stringer, yes, tried, to, Stringer tried, to, tried the Dusty Martin push off, didn't quite get it, ping for holding the ball. 
Far north looking for options here. This bloke's streaming down the side. He's got he's got no one moving apart from a short no, kick. That's gee. a great mark, but there's just no moving up forward at the moment for far north. Tries a handball out to the right hand forward flank, and that's a good kick, is it? Or just falling short? So King O'Loughlin gets it. He gets it out to Gum. Burgoyne again. Gee, the same names coming up every time. Newton. Newton on the uh, right hand half back flank kicks out to the right hand wing. Remy North takes a good mark. Uh, yeah, it's over a great his head. mark by Remy. So North Jeez. looking for options here. Bascom streaming across. Oh, that's a bad kick. That Never mind. Sampson tries to pick it up. Far North handball without. That's a big old field with the kick down to the. Uh, oh, he's just just overcooked it a little bit. Oh, look at that. That's yes, filters. Uh. Far North looking a bit promising here, though he's being oh, held. He, oh, he got oh, the handball away, but there's. Um, Midwest players everywhere. Midwest, it looked like they're going to get it out here, and they've gone to Burgoyne. Oh, Burgoyne. Burgoyne will be looking probably for Bascom if he can find him. Here comes Gum. He's streaming down. He's dominated the back lines. Gum's got Bascom out on Gee, the wing. Gee, that's a wild, wild, wild kick, but he's had a good try at getting that. There's Ware to Mont Montgomery. Far north. Have it out, but that was Sims. He hits Good mark. kicks the ball out to the ball. Oh. Kick to the boundary and it's gone out. Right hard forward flank for far north. No change to the score. Midwest seven five to two goals straight. That's good numbers here at the stoppage. Quite a pack. Ball one by far north. Players all around it. To Sampson. Sampson, short kick onto Stringer. Play together so they know what they're doing there. To Montgomery, Mont good mark. Handball straight on there, playing on quickly. Back, back to Stringer, is it? Stringer. Stringer has dominated. Far North have it out. They're getting. They're running down the uh, grandstand wing. No, it's been held up by Midwest. Oh, they got the ball back again. So towards the centre, Bascom to, to Mac McGuinness. Beautiful great, kick. Great shepherd by Bascom as they head up for the ball. That's a nice. That's by well, well smothered by McGuinness there. Uh, that was a great smother the ball, holding the ball up on the uh, left half forward flank for Midwest for another chance for them to go forward. So Kosminski getting ready to ruck. All right, far west, far north, get it out. To Askham, Stringer, Stringer on the left. So Montgomery, but Montgomery spills it over the boundary. Fence was looming pretty quickly at him then. Quickie, I think he uh, juggled the ball over the boundary line. Yep. Oh, we're... So it's far north getting that one out. McGuinness is very quick. Oh, he handballed it. He got... Then Burgoyne. Burgoyne's playing a good game here. No, he's kicked it straight to far north. Far north on the centre half back. That's uh, Edmondson. Uh, North's dropped it. Took his eyes off it. Mid. So it's North. It's a King. Big left. Oh, and that's a, nice a great mark. mark out the back of the pack there. Just strolled around the back. and Cameron uh, Montgomery has the ball. Just a casual little mark there. To the, read the play absolutely brilliant around the back. Yes, he's very reliable, this fellow. But we won't put the knockers on him. Got a bit of a kick on him, has he? He's 35 out. Bit yeah, of a wet he, ball. He, he, might be able, he should be able to get this one. Directly in front. This would be given give them a forty one point lead. Oh, and he's just curled that round. That's a great kick. That looks like it's gone through for a goal. That's a goal yeah, by Montgomery. 
Midwest doing what they need to do. Cookie against Far yes. North. Far North, of course, uh, you know, coming into the uh, competition a couple of years ago. Still feel just feeling their way a little bit in the uh, Morlock Shield, and Midwest will be looking to try and uh, well, they need to win as by as much as they can in this game. They do. They need uh, need a good score to uh, kick on in this competition. Uh, the score is eight five fifty three to two goals straight. Twelve. Ball up. Carter's chipped it back to Stringer, missed it. Bascom, Samson, there's a scrap, they're scrapping on the ground, held up, holding the ball. Oh, he's called him holding the ball. I thought Gee. that was a little bit tough, but uh, never mind. You, that you was quick. To, you need to get the ball out as best you can. Yes, obviously the, the umpires are uh, showing them what's required, if they're consistent. No, free kick, play on. Brody Kenny, nice kick into the forward lines. Ball down the Kelsch. right forward pocket. That's a great solid bump there by uh, Far North, but unfortunately the ball's just gone out of bounds. Yep. Forward pocket for uh, Midwest. Who's that in the ruck there? Cookie? Kelsch. Kelsch. Oh, Kelsch. Kelsch back gets the top, tap down. down. Far North get it out though. They're. Uh, but they, they might clear this yet. Down the wing. So McAvoy's been held up there, right on the wing. Well, the umpire right on that, holding the ball there. I'm just in, incorrect disposal by the looks of that, dropping the ball. Absolutely. Yes. And he's called it the far north. Hmm. Far north. Through the wing position, they fly high. Oh, great leap Ooh. at the back there by the uh, Midwest player. Which is big pack forming, little handball out there. Unfortunately, went straight to the Midwest player. Far oh, north, great smother there. Great smother by Kosminski. Yeah, Kosminski fighting hard. He's got yep. two to beat though. That's right. As it kicks out to the uh, half half back flank for far north and out of bounds. So far north, they've got it on the um, far side wing. Into the right hand, oh, right gun, hand forward flank. He's just oh, kept that in play. That's gee, a great bit of play. Shoots out well the handle. I think he thought it was out, but it wasn't. Kenny. Kenny punches the ball. No, that was, sorry, that the was, sorry, that was Joey, Joey Williams. Just Pressure stopped. on here. Can Far North get a third? Oh, he's dribbled the ball and just missed to the right hand, left hand side as we look oh. at it. Great effort though by Far North. They moved the ball from the half back flank quickly down to full forward. No, that's right. A good pressure too from mid Midwest, but uh, yeah, that's their first uh, scoring up, scoring um, in this uh, well, probably a couple of quarters. So yeah, yeah, haven't scored, didn't score in the second quarter. So we've got Dudley kicking out, kicks it in towards Mitch Gum. That's gone over. So Gum's got it, but he's got, oh, he's got swamped. But he's got the free kick. Yeah, sling, slinging tackle there, I think. So uh, no. Midwest holding up far north yet again on the centre half back position, which they did most in the uh, second quarter, Cookie. Yes, they did. Oh, no, that's a well, good smothered. That's gone towards the boundary now. It's going to be the moment, I think, that far north need to uh, try and get a get a goal here in this in this forward stoppage area and uh, see if they can get a bit of momentum happening as the mm. ball comes out the back of the pack. Here they go. That's far great, north. That's a great heads-up handball. He needs to just bomb this forward and hope for a mark. Unfortunately, he's out number two to one. And oh, look at that. Like, uh, Dudley's got it. Dudley's got it. Out to... Out to Joseph Joey Williams. Williams. To Steve Paul. Stringer. Stringer's good with the ball. That's a great Dodges ball. and weaves. Rods. Ross Bascom. Yeah, Bascom with all the time in the world can have Bounces. a touchdown on the ground. 
Oh, out to centre half forward. He's got a leading player there, but unfortunately the ball's just fallen yep. short. No, it's a bit of a heavy ball, this one. Yep. Still a bit damp on the ground. McGuinness has got the ball there. Uh, sorry, no, that's, that's Newton. Newton. Newton, two. Mont uh, no, it's Adam Harrell. Adam Mr. Harrell, Mellis. about 35 metres out on a slight angle there, Cookie, and uh, yep. shouldn't have any problems from here. Yeah, he's usually uh, pretty reliable. We'll see how he goes here. I think that ball's dropping a bit short, though, I have noticed. So, uh, yeah, they would have to get a fair roost, I reckon. Comes in delivery on the left. Oh, that's a great looking kick if it's got the carry. And sneaks it in for, oh, Ooh, no, touch just, on the line. Yep, right on the line there. I thought that was going to clear him quite easily, yeah. which uh, takes Midwest to eight goals, 6.54 to two goals, one thirteen. So far north, get it out nicely. Good mark. That's Swain there on the uh, half-back flank. He's going to look forward to uh, Deed. Deed's Ooh. dropped the mark, unfortunately. Swain there in great sliding. And out. And he's managed to get the ball over the line for a stoppage. So uh, good play there by Swain. He didn't have a lot around him, so good best to hold the ball and regroup. Ball in. We've got Kosminski. Far north have it, though. Uh, oh, that's high. So a free kick to far north there. Oh, the kick's a little bit. Yeah, Carter's got it. Yeah, that was a misdirected kick. Carter's not sure where to go. He's oh, going he's, to bump it forward. Geez, he's got to play that forward. loose there. That's, uh, that's Montgomery, is it? Yes, Montgomery, has. he's, he's looking to get it. Yeah, McGinnis he's got hold of it now. Uh, held up. Umpires, umpires ball up. Ball up on a half forward flank for Midwest. Tapped out by far north. Oh, hands out by. Uh, they're still working hard, but they're working a lot harder this quarter, I think, than they were the last quarter. Yeah, definitely a lot better by, uh, by far north. Burgoyne. Burgoyne centres it. But I think that's all. Oh, there's, no, there's all sorts there. There's. We've got King O'Loughlin. North. Oh, great, great smell of the handle. McGuinness is still in there around there, but no far north have come away with it. Well, he's got to play loose out on the wing. Now he needs to drop his eyes and have a look forward to, for a leading player. Uh, nice Comes in long, kick. and that's a great kick. He just found Reese. Reese on the, uh, he's about 55 metres out on the uh, left half forward flank. He looks for a player there, and that looks like it's going to be DeBoer. DeBoer's yeah. Scott, Scott Montgomery's got it, I reckon. Oh, good mark by Dudley. Oh, Dudley, that was a great mark. Spin and turn. He's got the ball mm. right through to half forward flank. Oh. No, we have that was uh, Kenny, Kenny by the Brody look. Kenny. Yep. Kenny taken without the ball. <laughs> and Far North uh, have the ball. They've that's got Cassidy. Control. He gets the handball out. They're in the centre of the ground. That was Bascom. Bascom gum. Absolutely nothing back there for, and that's far north with two players loose. Player on the outer side here. That looks like it's uh, Edmondson. Edmondson's got the ball. Yeah, he, he in turn um, goes back into the centre. Far north are still struggling to get it forward here. They're getting, they're all right through the centre, but um, yeah, they're really struggling to for options. Oh, here we half. go, straight to Kosminski. Yeah. Once again, Cookie falling no, down on the sorry, uh, Paul. falling down on the half forward flank. They keep straight to gum, Paul to gum. That was good kick. Oh, uh, far north seemed to be getting it a little bit more this quarter. Still well, unforced errors hand. though. Yeah, unforced errors, which is going to give a chance maybe for Midwest, but no, that's far north are going to clear the ball out. Oh, oh. once again a turnover. It's a stringer. Stringer raises everywhere. your eyes. That's a great looking kick there to where Where's Wears had, had a go, but I think he's going to miss the whole yeah. lot and it's out of bounds on the full. Ooh. Far north looking to bring the ball back in. Heads down the line. That's a great heads. Oh, he's dropped the mark though. That's a careless error. So North held him up. He's got the ball. Oh, he's, I reckon he's going to get a free kick here. High. Yep. And he's he's probably within 
range, but he's, he's passed it up. No, the umpire's brought him back. He's brought him back. He did, he did have the option there, which I'm not sure who that is. That looks like it's... Uh, is that O'Loughlin, is it? Uh, yeah, King, probably. No, he's he's lining up here, I reckon, but uh, I don't. I think he'll fall short. Uh, he's just putting it to the square. We've got Kelsch going up. Good centering right, kick. Missed it. Plenty of far north players there, though. He's looked out. He's got... So Montgomery's on, on the far north there. Whoop. Oh, she's... There's a bit of ping pong going on here, I think. Oh, Nick, but Stringer's got it, and he and he Stringer's does. Stringer's got his heads up. Oh, but he was surrounded by five more players. Far north are uh, um, frustrating Midwest here a little bit, though. But uh, they're not getting it past that uh, centre line, really. No, so it seems to be a battle of the, uh, of the half back, half back, centre half backs. No. So Paul's got it. That was a, he held his ground well there. Steve Paul in the wing position, said centering Not ball. Not a bad kick. That's a Ooh. great leap there by... Uh, There's Kelsch. Kelsch to north. He's had so a snap in the corner. Oh. I reckon where... He's got the hold of it. He's got oh, a hold of it. Gonna, he loves he's this. going to go check side. Is it going to... Oh. oh. He needed a good break there to get that through. I think where needed a left foot. But a good good, good effort there by Eve. He was uh, trying to use his preferred foot, check side. Just went to the right-hand side of the uh, goalpost. Yes, it's always good to be uh, left and right. Far north to bring it in down on the... Uh, that's a great heads up there to uh, Edmondson. Edmondson oh, oh gee, they've, they've mucked it up here a little bit because uh, now the pressure's on far north. Is that so Montgomery? Montgomery Montgomery's getting a lot of the ball too, uh, so but no, he's kicked it straight to, straight to far north. north. Clearing kick out to the side, out to Deed. Deed hasn't got a lot, so he goes the handball. He needs to kick this ball long down the wing. He's gone for the shorter option. And that looks like it's number uh, Sims. So great mark there by Sims. So Brody Grokey, he's, he's played on here. So Grokey's trying to get to him. Good punch there by McAvoy. North. On to Carter. But, but far north now have it. Yes, yeah, a free kick there. Yeah, pushing the back for a free kick there. So out on the uh, grandstand side for uh, far north. Short little pass out. That was a good heads up. Far north looking to try and get uh, inside their forward 50. Here we That's go. Oh, he's missed that mark. But no, they've got the ball still. Could have been a free kick there, possibly. Great tackle there by... Uh, by Midwest, they get the ball back. So McAvoy was a good kick out there, but, but straight to Far North. Far North really have lifted their game here. We've got Steve Paul coming in on Far North, but they've got that looks like, two. Looks like now, it's, now there's pressure on. Mm -hmm. Lehman going for the one-two, didn't quite pay off. Right, that's play on, it's it's played forward. This is Ware. Come on, Ware's going to have a shot. He's going to have a shot. Oh, I reckon and I think he's nailed it quite easily. Yes. That was a nice kick. He certainly finishes well. Where? Plenty of space there for Ware Cookie. He didn't have anyone around him for about 15, 20 metres and had plenty of time to settle and put it straight through. Yeah, he certainly uh, finds space, all right. He's, he's, he's quite talented in that area and he's got a darn good kick too. So. Far north have just spent about the last 10 minutes uh, absolutely uh, dominating really in the back line, not allowing uh, Mid Midwest to go any further. But unfortunately with uh, Ware there, with no one checking him, it was an easy goal. Yeah, no, they've um, broken the drought here a little bit for this quarter, but uh, so it's eight, nine goals, seven to 61 to two goals, one, 13. Ball up in the centre, tap out towards Midwest. Newton's there, Burgoyne, Stringer's still there. Yeah, that's a great, great tackle to hold the ball up at centre half forward there for Midwest. Stringer having plenty of infants in the game, Cookie. Sure is. He's uh, he's dominated. That's touch play on, I think. Kick Here comes Carter. He's, he's, comes he's Carter. coming he's out. Streaming out. I don't know if I'd like to see him coming at you. You wouldn't get me in the way. No. Here's Burgoyne. Burgoyne, a bit of spray with the Here kick. Here we go again. Stringer. Stringer, Stringer on the left, he's, too. He's had a look. Oh, oh Kenny. That should be a free kick. That would be uh, nearly a free kick. He really got knocked over there. But anyway, there's the siren. 
Three quarter time here, Cookie. It's uh, nine goals, seven sixty one to two goals, thirteen. And uh, Midwest, probably not the best quarter they could have had. No, they uh, probably got held up a fair bit, lot more than by far north there. Uh, looks like there's a bit of drizzly rain coming in. It's been a pretty, pretty much a uh, dry weather game, really, except for a little bit of damp ball. Um, so the score at the end of this quarter is nine goals, seven sixty one to two goals, one thirteen for far north. And we'll be back uh, after the uh, three quarter time break. No worries, so uh, not much has changed. There was far north have the ball. A lot more endeavour by Midwest this quarter, Cookie. Yes, there sure is. Yeah, I think they uh, I think they went a bit quiet that last third quarter. So far north are still struggling to get options here. They uh, but they've taken a good mark. That's a great mark by Lehman. Right. Just right hand side of the centre. He's played clear. a good game, Lehman. He has um, played a good game. He goes to the right hand forward flank. There's a great fly ooh. there, but a good punch by Midwest. That looked yeah. like it was uh, that was gum, was it? No, I think that was McAvoy. McAvoy with the spoil. Stringer. So there's Stringer again to Burgoyne. That's a that's Burgoyne. Been, Burgoyne's got plenty of time here. He can get. It's been regularly set today, and then we go to Sampson. That's it, Sampson. Sampson. Oh, there's a lead coming out here. Oh, has he made it? No, that's Montgomery again. He's very good like that, but uh, Sampson has another crack. That's a terrible kick, but anyway, yeah. he's... Uh, Sampson need to follow that ball up on his first mm. endeavours there. Far north. They're getting it out, but uh, whether they can get it past the, the centre line, I don't know. No, good tackle, and it's out. Out of bounds on the grandstand wing, and uh, not much change to the score here. Cookie, I reckon Midwest will be looking to pile on three or four goals. Yeah, I reckon they're uh, they're aiming for um, a big, big win here. Um, With a wet day on Monday too, I think yes. this first game is going to be the all important one. Yes, it's all about um, percentage. So far north, but once again, they're going to be here. We go. We have got Dudley. Dudley's, Dudley's got a ball. Well, Dudley's got, got a the ball on a string. Here. He's on his way. Looking for options. Not much coming towards him. Yep, Newton's out there. That's Rocky Newton. He's kicked it in to Stringer again. Stringer's just taking a little easy chest mark. Stringer mark. 50 out. Oh, he's going to find a loose player on the half forward yeah, flank. Yeah, we've got Carter there. Yeah, Carter just drifting down, uh, cutting across the ground there. He looks like he's going to be about probably 40 metres out. Ball relatively new, so uh, he should have a good chance here to uh, kick the 11th for Midwest Cookie. Yes, he should. He's, uh, he's He'll be uh, reasonably accurate. We won't, we'll just see how he goes here. Come well off the boot, and it's straight, I reckon, if it gets oh, there. Oh, just short, is just it? Yeah, short. cuts on the line. No, that's a common theme today, I think. There's been a few, uh, obviously the ball's a little bit heavier than they think, maybe. No heavy. wind to be seen, though. Not a thing. It's perfect, really. Heavy ground, hev heavy ground, heavy legs, as we see uh, far north bringing the ball out, just into the into the back pocket for him. There's a lead out here. To... Yep. That looks like uh, Cassidy. He's got the ball. Oh, yes. Oh, he's, oh just oh, over the top there. Oh, that's a good that's, mark. That's there. a great mark there by, yeah, by Steve Paul. Paul. Steve Paul looking for options. He's going to come out to the uh, outer side here, yeah, which so is uh, Baskin. So we've got Roscoe Baskin here again. Baskin's going to thump to the ball Samson. down. Oh, Samson, what a great lead-up that was. Gee, there's uh, plenty of Midwest in plenty of space around the ground. And Stringer again. Yeah, Stringer followed up from uh, from his kick and uh, just drifted down to the forward pocket. I reckon he'd be on a 45-degree angle here and probably, what, 35 out, Cookie? Yeah, yeah, probably about 35, I reckon. We're directly behind the ball here so we can see him coming in. Stringer having a ripper, ripper game all over yeah. no, as he comes in. He has played a good game. And that ball drifting around. Is, oh, oh, he's hit the, hit, hit the woodwork. I reckon that's the first one we've seen all day today. Yep, that's... Uh, but never mind, they'll, um, so far north, ready to go. Here they kick to the uh, pocket, and good mark. Yeah, that was a great mark there by uh, by uh, Dallas. So heading down along, along the wing. Far north are breaking down through there. That uh, seems to be just mid-north, mid-west numbers. They just seem to be... Uh, Seem to be uh, able to hold them up pretty well. 
Yeah, clearly mid, mid, Midwest. Samson has the ball. Samson, that's a great looking goal. kick. Yeah, that's another one there. Midwest yeah. definitely uh, definitely more hungry for the ball in this last quarter. They're going to see them go to uh, 11 goals, 11 to yes. 2 goals, 1. And uh, that's definitely going to be probably the ball game cookie. Yep, I think so. It's, um, it's quite a dominating effort, this one. Like we've been saying, the, uh, the, the first game in Mortlock is... Uh, or with this being the second second game, is uh, is always the most important one. If you can if you can get a really big margin, it puts you in a, in a good position to where you're going to play on on the uh, the Mortlock Monday. Yes, uh, this would have been right uh, right uh, falling right into their uh, plans. Um, so yeah, ball up. Kelsch, Kelsch gets a good tap out straight to far north though. though that's a lot of pressure on their tackle. Oh no! Look, there's Bascom's got him. I think. No, sorry, it was Remy North. He thumps it into forward lines, and Samson is sitting under the ball. Great follow-up from Samson. He just made himself a little bit of space, probably about 40 metres out on a 45-degree angle, maybe a little bit less. Yes, he's, he's going to be able to kick this distance, he believes. And that looks a fine kick. Oh, there we go again. So it's 12 goals, 11, 83 to two goals, 113. So that's a 70-point lead. Yeah, I think uh, Far North need to uh, just try and finish out this game a little as, as strongly as they can. Of course, uh, second year in the competition, so uh, it's never easy coming to, from the furthest distance, probably just about, I'd say, but... Uh, and uh, yeah, and a lot of guys showing a fair bit of commitment. But if they can just run, try and just run the game out and uh, keep Midwest to where they are, I think they'll 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 be thinking they've uh, they've done a reasonable job. Yeah, they've got a bit of pride to keep. So we've got uh, Kelsch. He's got the ball. That Stringer was held up far north here. Th no, Samson again. No, Stringer, Stringer again. Stringer backing up on the right of half forward flank. He's got good eyes. eyes, this bloke. He's gone straight to Montgomery. Yeah, watch out for Stringer here. I reckon he'll come come down further. And we've got he's Montgomery's a beautiful kick to wear. Yeah, that was a great lead by Ware. He, he must have led for at least twenty five metres there, and uh, he's going to line up uh, probably about twenty five thirty metres out on the uh, half forward flank. So uh, yet another shot for Midwest. Stringer's going to the bench, probably for a rest. But he's uh, probably been almost one of the best on ground, I'd say. Ware has... He's put it straight through the centre. That is a thumping kick by Ware yep. as well. So uh, once again, another goal to Midwest. 13 goals, 11, 89 to two goals, one thirteen. Mm. And Stringer, absolutely fantastic game. He's probably got a sore foot is why he's going off. And uh, <laughs> he, he's had the ball on a string today. He has. He's been... Uh, Quite impressive. Game gone a little bit quiet in this uh, in this quarter, but uh, everyone else seems to be. Well, that's right. The ball hasn't actually got down there, I suppose. But uh, yeah, so as we got the ball in the centre square again, and the umpire throws the ball up. So Kelsch has it out. No far north have it. They seem to get the ball in the centre a fair bit, but then. Uh, here they are. They're, they're getting their first chance down down their forward lines. Yeah, plenty of numbers for Midwest. So they've they've got two loose players out on the uh, left half back flank. So Gum uh, kicked to, to Montgomery. Gum, Montgomery's gone to the boundary. By the look of it, I'm not sure if that was a safety play or uh, straight off the side of the boot. I reckon Cookie. Very much side of the boot. I think they probably can afford a few little mistakes. But anyway. So we've got Kelsch going again here. Um, straight over the back of him, though, and uh, to McAvoy, to Burgoyne. Remy North. No, they're streaming away with this now. And North's gone straight down Montgomery. Montgomery's unlucky to get that, but he's good on the ground. Got it away. I think that's Kosminski. Oh, that was a great hip and shoulder there, trying to hold him up. Far north, trying to clear the ball out. There's no one for him to go whatsoever. He's tackled but taken high, so it'll be a uh, free kick to far north. Oh, yeah, far yep. north. Far north. Have it. Oh, there's punched out by north. Far north have it, though. They're, they're going all right here. And they're streaming down the uh, grandstand wing. 
But Gum, Gum has got in front and taken a great mark. Great play by Gum there. He looks out to uh, the centre-half back position. He's got a player there, free, which is Baskin. Baskin. Baskin playing another great game. And Joey Williams. Williams jogging down the uh, wing to Kenny. Yeah, Kenny just drifted into a little bit of space there. He's going to look forward to see who he can find. Big lead coming out from full forward. Oh, that was close by Montgomery Oh, there. that's a mark. I would have thought it was, but he's going to ball it up, I think. Maybe the second grab was touched by one of the uh, far north players as he balls, balls up at centre-half forward for Midwest. Oh. Uh, yeah, yeah, so like New New Newton having a flying shot at goal and straight off the side of the boot and uh, clearly missed him by about 30 yards. Yes, it looked good for a sec. Slippery conditions makes it a little bit harder to kick the ball, of course. Yes, I think there could possibly be some uh, little showers come through soon and later. It's going to make it interesting for the uh, for the rest of the afternoon if we get a few showers. Of course, the score is going to be lower, and with Midwest on 13 goals, 11, that's putting him in a pretty good position. It has. Um, normally, you expect a, a, a quite a showery, wet conditions for the the first game in the morning, but it seems to be the, it seems to be quite good conditions for football out here at the moment. Mewburn had the ball, took it out to the right-hand forward flank, who then in turn kicked it out to the right-hand wing, the grandstand side wing. Far north trying to get that ball past the centre square, and they're struggling. Yep. Oh, look at that. Once again, that looks like that was, that was Bascom who yes. uh, dropped the mark, but he's been paid because uh, the far north player was not watching the ball. Yeah, no, Bascom coming back into it a bit again. He's got options. Great and kick, thumping kick there by Bascom. Looks like Kenny out there tracing the ball. Uh, Dudley. Oh, he's got caught holding in the ball, I think. And that yeah. was Dudley, I reckon. Yeah, or Dudley, inc incorrect disposal. Yeah. Just lost his footing at the wrong time, unfortunately. Yeah. Short little passes. Craig, uh, Hall, Craig Hall, he's going to bring the ball out here to uh, to Deed. Deeds looks like he's a bit free. He's got the handball off. Oh, oh. he's got the ball, but he's got a... Oh, yes, he's got the ball away. That's Swain. Swain's going to kick the ball for far north to the centre half forward position, and oh, that's a great that's mark the there. That's a great mark. That's uh, far north's best effort for a fair while. That looks like if it's number sixteen by the book, that's Jake DeBoer. So he's going to line up about. He's a fair way out. He's a. Uh, well, he'd have to be at least forty-five out, I reckon. Cookie. Yeah, forty-five. He's just he's just almost kicking from the. Oh, he's he's, hand, he's handed off to Swain. Swain's gone for the big big kick. It's the right-hand side, and it's just going to drift off. And I think that's gone out of bounds there. Out yeah. of bounds just to the uh, left-hand side point post, grandstand side. Yeah, that's their first positive move for the for a fair while. But um, yeah, you'd like them to uh, you know, to get a get a get a score on the board. But uh, anyway, not going to show chance. any bias, Cookie. No, none at all. To Samson, and we've got Paul running past, and he's running hard. Paul hasn't got a lot of lot of options. He's and gone he's over got, the top. He's got and Montgomery. Montgomery. He's going to run onto it. He's kicked the ball off the ground. Still after the ball. He's going to pick this up here, and he's and he's just kicked it into the centre. Great and he's centering got kick. King O'Loughlin there. King O'Loughlin probably might be just within range. He looks like he's going to be deliberately having a shot. Is he? Yeah, well he, can, he's, he can get that distance. Um, so it's going to take a good kick with a uh, with a, with heavy feet. Hmm. Lachlan looking like he's about forty metres out, directly in front. I'm thinking this probably will drop short a little bit. Anyway, oh, no, a, that was that's a, a thumping thumper. kick. Unfortunately, he just dragged it to the right hand side, going for distance. So that big uh, left, left hook, left foot hook. Midwest 13-14, still streaming away to two goals, one far north. So they've got their uh, target, um, so far north, kicking to the centre. Oh, that's a, that's a great heads-up kick there to Rhett Sims. Rhett Sims goes down the right-hand side. He's trying, trying so to find... So we've got... We've got far north and Gums picked it up. He's, he's uh, absolutely... Oh, that's a great mark. He's defended beautifully along there. Stringer. That's uh, Damien King on Lachlan. Yeah, he's, he's gone a heads up in this. Oh, great leap there by the uh, Midwest player. Yes, that was uh, Montgomery. Far he, north he clearing out, though, to the... Uh, 
Carter's, Carter's all by himself out here on the wing. Carter has 30 metres, can probably afford to take a bounce. Looks in board. Oh, he had plenty of time there. And he's Midwest players everywhere there, Scott Cookie. Felder, uh, Scott, uh, Scott Montgomery. Yeah. Ball up in the uh, centre half forward position for Midwest. Oh, that surely that should surely be a high be. tackle. Mm. Far no, I don't think I saw that. There's yeah. the siren. There's the siren. It's uh, well interesting game there, Cookie. Yes, it was. It's uh, quite interesting in the in the sense of Midwest. Uh, that was a very dominating performance there. It was thirteen. The final score was uh, thirteen goals, twelve ninety. To two goals, one thirteen. So was looking like it was going to be shades of last year and kicking twenty one points at one stage. There, a few misses in a row, but their second quarter and third, well, mainly their second quarter when they kicked those four or five in a row was a really good quarter. Yeah, their their second quarter was the real clincher. They they started getting um, getting going then. Yes, I uh, it nearly brought back bad memories there with those points from last year. But uh, no, they have really kicked away and done a uh, done a, a, a dominating uh, performance here today. So. And let's not take anything away from Far North either, Cookie. They uh, for a good tour and a half quarters there. They held up Midwest at the uh, in, at, at Midwest's seven centre half forward position constantly with the attack of that Midwest were trying to do. Uh, just every so often they broke the lines unfortunately and uh, and couldn't stop them. But you know, far north once again, you know they they've got another game to redeem themselves. So let's uh, let's uh, let's hope they can do uh, a little bit better next game. Yeah, uh, far north they they showed patches. You know, they they look good at times. Um, if they could just link it all together, they would have been uh, they would have done quite a bit more really. Um, but you know they'll uh, they'll have another crack in the next game and uh, try and redeem themselves. That's it. So the uh, final scores were mid uh, mid uh, west were thirteen twelve ninety to far north two goals one. Do you have an upcoming event? Reach an audience beyond the venue. Live streaming your events allows you to reach a global audience. Letting people all over the world watch, engage and interact with your content in real time. By providing a live stream of your event, those who would previously be missing out can watch and engage from their office, home or mobile device. Live streaming can provide an additional way to generate income and exposure. Conferences. Awards nights. Sporting events. Concerts. Community events. Get your message on air with onair.com. I was in a really bad car accident. If the fire and rescue mob weren't there, I mightn't be here. See the change your banking can make. Bendigo Bank. Be the change. Australians! 
Optus 4G Plus network now covers more of you than ever. So you can post fast, watch fast, play fast, just like me. Put your brand in the palm of the hand of thousands of sports viewers from your local area and even across the globe. Social media-based live streaming has the potential to reach well beyond your existing network. Sport fans are the most engaged viewers, both on television and online, which means more viewers who see your ads and are more likely to act on them. Talk to Mortlock Shield about advertising in 2019 to our growing audience and support local footy. What a night we have in store. CM Punk returns to the octagon. Two belts on the line. You ain't seen nothing like this. Do you have an upcoming event? Reach an audience beyond the venue. Live streaming your events allows you to reach...